All right. Very good. Very good. So, just as I thought, as long as I connect the wallet, then I can actually see the real, the real data. Okay. So, this is definitely a cropped farmer fork. Uh, it's pretty funny because they're similar, similarly named to, I think, a recent rug pull. Or maybe I'm confusing it with BNB Ring. Supposedly that project pulled. I mean, I just went by the com Someone just left a comment there and I just simply pinned it. I mean, I'm not... In yeah, I don't invest in, like, these, you know... I don't invest anymore in low TVL weird projects because if they're not doing a whole lot of marketing, then I'm like, eh, not really interested. I'm better off just... Putting more money in the BNB miner or crops farmer projects, right? So, especially now that they have crops BUSD yield staker, I'm actually thinking if if crops farmer comes out with more yield stakers, not just for Binance Dollar, but for like AVAX or BNB, that's actually going to be massive, right? You're just going to make like endless amounts of money. So basically, I want Rocket Science Zone, but for all of the cryptos across the chain. So for me, crops farmer is my favorite. Uh, project by far, but BNB miner is also just as good because they've been around literally forever, and they only seem to concentrate on BNB miner, which is fine. So, you know, so I'm 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 good on the safe projects, but a I need to cover new projects just so I can grow the channel, and then b people probably still want to do other projects anyway, right? You know, as crazy as it is, because you never know, you might actually find like you know a good project eventually, right? And that's that's the important thing. And of course, I tell you about it. I put my own money into it if I like it, obviously, and you know, so on and so forth. So, all right. So this one, I don't even remember who this on you, who I got this from from YouTube, but this is obviously a crops farmer fork. You know, they basically copied uh, the code, of course, and then you know they made a little bit of changes. <clears throat> all right. So there is a mandatory ten times compounding. And, okay, so they don't tell me, lit all right, so this is already a problem. They don't tell you anything. So now you're going to make me find out how this project works here. Why is this not working? God, this is so annoying. So these guys are, like, literally very lazy. So I really don't like that. You get 6% a day. We saw that on the front page. But what are the timers? Alright. Alright, here we go. Uh, okay. To withdraw cooldown, time is the amount of time one has to wait before they can make a narrow withdrawal. This prevents the blah blah. The team is saying that this could be adjusted, slow down the rate of withdrawal, but it can be set to a value less than or equal to 24 hours. Okay, yeah, I figure it's every 12 hours. I just wanted, but they didn't say it in the front page. That's why I want to check to see what the actual thing is. Um, okay, so supposedly you have to wait 24 or less hours. I mean, this thing is worded very in a very confusing manner. All right. Okay, and it says every 12 hours. And then, of course, there's the 80% tax. That's what I'm looking for. Okay, there's a bonus on every compound of 4%, and the max bonus is 40% after five days. Okay. So... Does it even say what your bonus? It doesn't even say, uh, does it? Okay, so honey, bot build. Yeah, see, they didn't even did they even write the bonus on the front page? They should at least say there's a bonus on the front page. I mean, the TVL on this should be a lot higher, but because they are not saying anything on the front page and they're making people read this, that actually makes the project lose a lot of money. It, it, it's actually kind of very annoying. I mean, I understand that I'm lazy too, but notice that I also don't run any projects, all right? You know, because if I put in that little effort in a pro, uh, crypto project, yeah, of course my pro crypto project's going to fail, right? Or it's definitely going to uh, not have as much money as it should have. So, you know, 
But, you know, hey, at the end of the day, at least it's a crops farmer fork, so it should, it should still stick around a lot longer than every other project. All right. Uh, okay. What's to be able to utilize the compound feature? The player cannot. All right, so this is also not written in primary English, so, okay. For those who choose not to play a game only sell, it'll be 80% tax, right? The other way to do it 10 times. For, da, 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 da. Yeah, I recommend a strategy BS. All right, believe it or not, I'm actually going to have to link to this particular page, right? So you can read the specifics. But basically, it's Crops Farmer. There's a 4% bonus on every compound. Now, they said it goes up to 40% max. Is that what it said? Yeah. 40% max after five days. That's actually incorrect, right? No, that's actually correct, yeah, after five days, because two compounds every uh, per 24 hours, assuming you instantly compound, right? Obviously, that's just impossible. Uh, but, yeah. Okay, so there's a max compound rate of 40%. And then you have your bonus. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, see, it's not even going to tell you what it is until you actually put money in. So that's why you have to write you know, all this on the front page, right? Just tell people what they're getting, right? You know, so. But, eh, whatever. I mean, that's just how it goes. That's how the person who runs this project, you know, did it. And, of course, even with uh, the problems, you know, it still has an okay amount of Binance coin, like 91.29 Binance, which is actually a lot compared to really a lot of other projects. Like, I don't know why people are still viewing the baked beans format of miners, right? The crops farmer has shown you the way, just like this project has. So just do it the crops farmer way, and then your project will last a lot longer. There'll be more TVL, right? And then, well, I mean, and then after that, I mean, it's just like a matter of how long do you want to last, right? <clears throat> but with that being said, uh, this project does look pretty fine to me. Let's see, they're not using any fakes, so that's good. Uh, they're on DAP Radar, which was May 26, that's five days ago. They're not very active on the marketing, so they're really just relying on word of mouth. Which I guess I'm okay with, but uh, as long as they're not a scam project and they're going to run full, I, I guess it should be fine. Uh, but either way, um, is there anything else I want to say? Mm, let's see. No, I want to get back to my game, and I want to get back to the market specifically. I probably want to eat a little bit too. So I don't know. I got stuff to do, but I mean, as always, actually, we do want to look at the markets real quick. Yeah. So we might probably are gonna pull back one to one point twenty-five percent, hopefully. All right. Yeah. Look at that dollar index. But I mean, the dollar's been getting pounded like crazy too. It's like it went from like what one hundred three, one hundred four, down to like one hundred one. That's a major pullback, or major, major dump. So it's going to have to do a, the reverse of that eventually. Let's see. Debt market. Yeah, it's looking pretty good. All right, so I'm definitely going to be buying uh, crypto today. So I mean, not crypto. I'm going to definitely be buying spider calls today, but I got to sell one of my in-profit spider calls right at the open. You know, so I'll do some research. Oh, that's right. I got to do... Hold on. I was... Let's see, what's the website? Unusual Whales? Yeah, that's it. All right. So I gotta keep that open. Alright, like, subscribe, share this video around. Um, I don't have anything more to say. I was just checking around to see if there was anything important. And yeah, I mean, it's looking pretty good. I mean, everything is working as it should. We're getting away, further away, further and further away from bear market territory. And that's a good thing. Meanwhile, you know, interest rates continue to go up in a, in a controlled fashion. Uh, so as long as uh, that continues to happen, we can continue playing, you know, the long market. And hold on a sec. What is going on here? Yep, there you go. I just have to move that. Hit publish. Bingo. And then, yeah, I'm just big chilling, and you should be too. So like, subscribe, share. I think I already said that, right? Thank you again to all the new and old people watching this video. <clears throat> and then I guess I'll see you all tomorrow. Right now, there's just not a lot of crypt new crypto projects popping up. I mean, people are still are still like staying away from crypto overall, and of course, money's probably tight. So all my YouTube sources are not getting paid. <laughs>
to make their uh, you know videos on what's most likely a scam project, right? So that's just how it goes. And to be honest, I really don't feel like researching, you know, my uh, just doing random X Y Z. It takes a lot of effort, and at the end of the day, it doesn't get a lot of views anyway. Especially because the project's like dead or borderline dead, right? So, but that's okay. I mean, if things are slow, then things are slow. You know, I'm perfectly fine with it. But yeah, if I start seeing there's not enough, you know, content, you know, think of something else. Yeah. So, all right. So I think I'll see you all tomorrow. I did deliberately ignore one project called Retro Russian Studio. Yada Crypto actually covered it, but. Immediately, I already just thought it could be a scam, right? Simply because how are they getting the, uh, you know, licensing deals for the films and stuff? Oh, but they promise everything else. So it, re it reminds me a lot like um, that Mad Max game project that I covered. So I'm like a little uncomfortable. It's like, okay, I think, I think, I'm, I'm, I'm paranoid about the scam rug pulls because there's a lot more happening right now. So that's why I don't want to like cover something that could actually be just a giant fancy scam. So, you know, we'll, we'll take a look. So, anyway, I'll see you next time. Maybe it'll be tomorrow, but whenever there's some projects to show up. But, again, things are slow, so whatever. All right. Oh, yeah, this thing is already way too, uh, going to get too long.